You're probably wondering why it's valid to use ARMA models for stationary time series data. Well, this question was answered in part by Herman Wold, who showed that any stationary time series can be written as a linear combination of white noise. We can also show that any ARMA model is a linear combination of white noise. This means that ARMA models are well suited for describing the dynamics of stationary time series. The moving average model is already in this form, as, and as it turns out, all ARMA models are of this form. R provides an easy way to simulate these models. The function is called arima.sim. The basic syntax are to specify the models using a list and then specify how many observations you want. There are a few ways to specify the model, but the easiest way is to specify the order P, the AR order, D, which we haven't discussed yet, and Q, the MA order. For example, to generate data from an MA1 with parameter 0.9, specify the model as a list with order equals 001 and MA equal 0.9. In this case, we'll generate 100 observations. In this example, we'll generate and plot 100 observations from an AR2 with parameters 0 and minus 0.9. Notice that the data are somewhat cyclic a lot like the Southern Oscillation Index. Okay, your turn.